Ladies and gentlemen, oh man, I had the hardest time getting my GoPro to start recording today. I don't know why. I hit the button like four times, it still wasn't turning on once. I actually had to pull over and try again. For those of you who are new, hello, my name is Renegade. This that I'm sitting on is my 1993 Yamaha XJ600, fully customized. And since it is such a nice day out today, nice evening, however you want to look at it, I figured I'd take her out for a nice little ride. So I was stopping, I was thinking about it earlier. And uh, I've been trying to do this YouTube thing for a little while now, uh, a little over six months, but I'm really trying to step up my game in the last six months. And. Uh, <laughs> I actually know that because if you go back through the archives, so to speak, you'll find a, uh, a video about plans for this coming year. I'll have it linked in the description, and I'll see if I can get one of those little cards to pop up. But, uh, I, I made this video talking about plans for this year, and I made that in January. In fact, I can tell you the exact day I started recording it. I started recording it on the 16th. Now the reason that I, I know this is because during that video, I was running errands, I stopped at the library nearby, and I met this girl who I was talking to about steel brake lines on my bike, and how in the middle of January, I was taking my bike out riding, and this is why. Well, fast forwards about a week, and the girl and I started dating. Now, six months have gone by, a little over six months. I'm still dating the same girl. That girl who I met six months ago while making a video for YouTube was Victoria. It's crazy to stop and think about how time has gone by, you know? Anywho, I made this video about it. And uh, I continued to make videos, and I, I kind of... I don't know, I, maybe I lost my sight a little bit about what I wanted to do with my channel. And uh, some of it's just been, you know, just how life happens. But since that day, I got a new job, which means better income. Uh, obviously got the girl, score, and uh, started a, a new build project. I haven't done a whole lot with it, obviously, but I've been working on the Ninja a little bit here and there. Uh, I still need to get her to bring the bike over, and I need to, we need to order parts and really get down to it, you know? I, I really want to get this bike going and going better very soon. Now, in that video, I mentioned a few things that I was hoping to do with, uh, with my life and with the channel, uh, possibly a trip down to DC on the motorcycle. Um, I still want to do that. I just haven't yet. Uh, same with doing more, more builds and possibly rebuilding my first bike, my Maxim, which I still have. But uh, I haven't done that yet either because at the time I was making that video, I wasn't planning on meeting a girl who would eventually buy a bike and who was then going to, uh, you know, be talking about a custom build. I do feel like I've made a good amount of progress though with this channel so far. And uh, at this point, I'd like to stop and thank everybody who has subscribed to me right now. Uh, there's not a whole lot. I haven't had some amazing growth in the six months. I admit this. But for those who are following me, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, it does mean a lot. And if you're following me on Instagram, being, <laughs> again, thank you. It means a lot, uh, you know. Anytime you're talking about just some random dude who is trying to, to do something, you know, hey, score one, right? Apparently there's a really nasty accident up that way. 
Thank heavens we're going this way. So yeah, let's see. Uh, six months time. In six months time, I have finished my bike, got it to the sport bike setup that I really wanted. It is just more comfortable for me. Um, started another build. It's a slow build, but it's, you know, it's still a build. Got the new job, got the girl. Uh, I've definitely learned to ride better. My 400 was a lot of fun, and it did teach me how to ride a motorcycle, but... Mercy here has really made me kind of pick up my game. But I'm still planning on going forward and, uh, you know, doing more builds. One thing that I'm really hoping for, and this is down the road. This is not happening right away. This is down the road, okay? We're talking like once I get enough subscribers and people who actually want to pay attention and, you know, we can get some, uh, some more interactive content going on here. One day I'd really like to make a Patreon and do what people like, you know, Motonosity. Hey, another girl. You know, do things like Motonosity and uh, Chase on Two Wheels are doing. You know, taking bikes and building them and then possibly giving them away or something, you know? Because currently with my income, I cannot afford to buy another motorcycle and to buy all the parts to do it all on my own. Now, as a bit of a juggling act and some of the money I'm making has to go towards saving and etc. But, uh, you know, down the road, maybe that's something that could be done. Maybe uh, start the Patreon thing and get some, get some bikes going, you know, some real custom builds building the Renegade way. I mean, you guys have seen what I did with my, uh, with my XJ600, and I know you guys weren't following me for the whole build, because I didn't start this YouTube thing until after I was mostly done. I do kind of regret that, but I, I did show you pictures of where the bike was when I first got it. I'll show you one now. And then where the bike is now in its finished state. You know, that, that's a big difference. And, uh, you know, not including the fact that the bike wasn't running properly. And, you know, I did all these different upgrades to it to make the bike run and ride and perform better. Uh, anywho, I'm rambling now. But, uh, you know, if you guys liked what I did with the XJ600, let me know down in the comments and maybe, uh... You know, maybe I can give this Patreon thing a little more thought. Like I said, it's, it's not going to happen right away because it really wouldn't do me any good. Um, you know, it's a, it's a down the road type of thing. And I am still thinking about doing a DC trip, although I'm just, I'm not sure when. Um, you know, working and having a job kind of takes away the, the opportunity you can just like, you know, sky one out. I wish I could just ditch any time I wanted, but, you know, I do have responsibilities. And uh, I, I wish I had more more subscribers and more followers and whatnot. Not because, like, you know, I'm, I'm greedy and, you know, all that. But because I, I see the way that uh, other YouTube people, uh, vloggers or creators, whatever you want to call them, I, I see the way that they do things. And uh, if they go on a vacation, maybe they'll do a mini-meet somewhere that they're going. And I think that'd be cool, you know? Not just because I want people to meet me, but because I'd like to meet more people myself, and, you know, uh, maybe there are a couple of subscribers of one person that don't know each other. You know, person A and person B are subscribed to this channel, and they don't know each other. Well, you go to Mini Meet, maybe you meet, maybe, uh, you know, maybe a friendship has started, maybe some some shared ideas. Hey, they repaved this intersection. Thank heavens. This used to be the worst intersection ever. I'm actually currently taking the back roads up to the uh, 
the local mall, and by that I mean, you know, the local mall, because it's like an hour away from us. <laughs> We, we don't really have much in, in Cape May. So yeah, like I said, I mean, I've got different ideas of things that I want to do. Um, I especially have uh, end goals, you know, things that I would love to be able to do, but I had to work to get there, you know. I, I would love to do more builds. Uh, I'd love to get a bike and, you know, do something similar to what Chase on Two Wheels does, where he takes it from being essentially trash to something custom, something awesome. I know Jarrett Campisi is currently working on a carbon fiber uh, V4, Pen uh, V4 Panigale, I believe. Yeah, I know it's a Ducati. I have to double check that. Um, you know, he's got this brand new bike and he's already going to customize it. That's pretty darn cool too, but a Ducati, a brand new Ducati, you know, it's just, it's just not in my price range. Plus, I kind of want to take something that that could have life and rebuild it when I do this. You know, something that could have life but doesn't, and rebuild it so it's not just scrap. You know, I don't know about you guys, but I really think I need more of these uh, long rides. You know. I mean, I haven't been taking enough long rides lately. It's just been a lot of like, you know, short jaunts. Maybe a, a local ride, or I've been using the bike for transportation, like doing from work, running errands and whatnot. Yeah, I really need to take some, some nice long rides. So what do you guys think? What would you guys like to see me do? What would you like to see more videos of? You know one of the things I love about making videos on YouTube? <laughs> it gives me more of an excuse to go out riding. So yeah guys, tell me down in the comments what you think uh, you'd like to see more from this channel. I'd really like some feedback. I'd like to see what people are thinking. And uh, as always, you know, Feel free to leave a like, leave a comment. Uh, you know, I'm certainly not against the idea of communication and whatnot. And uh, if you're not already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you see more content. And hit the notification bell so that you get notices when I actually post things. And always, down in the comment, or down in the description will be the links to all my social media. Y'all have a nice day, thanks for watching. Remember, my name is Renegade, and I'll see you all in the next one. Keep taking care of business.